And that cool down is just in time for the Ozark Empire Fair. It opens this afternoon. There will be concerts, crafts, even a few nights in shining armor. Caitlin Schumacher is live at the fairgrounds this morning to tell us about the Knights of Valor who will be showing off some of their medieval gear. We never know what we're going to find Caitlin in this morning. Good Good morning. Yes, I'm here with Shane Adams and the Knights of Valor. They got me all dressed up. And let me tell you, this armor, I think, weighs more than I do. But Shane, tell me a little bit about what people can expect from your show. Well, for people who have been here at the Ozark Empire Fair before to watch us do full contact jousting tournaments, we are going to do just that, but just having two nights do live presentations twice daily through the week, three times on the weekend, but we're also going to turn it around into an educational performance as well, where people are going to be learning all about knights and the things that they did back then. Fantastic. All right, so you have some medieval weapons or some cool things to show off. So we have a whole bunch of medieval weapons. Of course, we have all the swords and armor that the knights wore, but we also brought a siege weapon. Now, this siege weapon is right behind you, and we're going to get you to launch the first watermelon out of that siege weapon today. We're going to take you over right, to TJ. Come on over here. This is Sir Theodore, TJ Duquette from Canada. He's one of our knights here, and he is also a siege weapons expert. He's going to have you grab that rope, and you're going to pull this trebuchet. Nope, whoop, whoop, this way, whoop. this way, yep. Stand away from the trebuchet. Away? Yes, you want to be All at that right, point. The reason the rope's this long is uh, when that fires, the other rope is going to swing around it, and trust me, if you get hit in the head, even with a helmet, it won't feel nice. Okay. So stay away from the trebuchet. All right, so just pull real hard. Pull as hard yep. as you can. All right, here we go, ready? And One, two, three. Keep pulling. Woo! <laughs> Okay, step okay. out from the rope. There you go. Come uh, on over here. I know okay, now what else are we going to be doing? A lot of things to show you. We're going to introduce you to one of the guys that, if you stay here, you'll actually be jousting with today. This is Kyron Fairchild up here on that beautiful horse, Superman. He was seen in that TV show, Full Metal Jousting. He was one of the stars of the show. Go ahead, Kyron, just charge down and show the speed. So when these knights hit each other, they hit each other with upwards of about 5,000 pounds of force and impact right here into this gritty grand guard. So it doesn't deflect left or right. These knights receive that full force of impact at a combined speed of 50 miles an hour. So what you're going to see here basically is the demolition derby of the Middle Ages. Okay. Now with that, the weapon that these knights use is a solid wooden lance. It's not a theatrical lance. It's not cut, prepped in any way, shape, or form to break. It's not made out of balsa. It's made out of Douglas fir. I'm going to show you how heavy this lance is. Our, one of our main squires right here, Steve, he's our head squire. He's going to hand you this weapon. It's one-handed. Hold it up there. Yep. So just hold it like that for a second. Gotcha. You feel the weight? Yep. Okay, now you have to tuck it underneath your arm. Doing this right? Reach over. There you go. There Good. Go. And hold on to it tight. Holding tight. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I don't know. This armor weighs enough. I don't know if I can hold this too. <laughs> and that's how pole vault something was actually invented. And knights would pole vault themselves off the back of the horses. But these are the weapons that these knights will be hitting with you know, throughout our shows here at the Ozark Empire Fair. All right, sounds good. If you want to catch the Knights of Valor show, you can come out to the Ozark Empire Fair. Today is opening day. Starts at 4 o'clock. For all the information you need, go to ky3.com and the KY3 News app. I need out of this armor, so I'm back to you. <laughs> Caitlin Schumacher for us. Keeping us on our toes. There's a, clearly a lot to see.